Hey YouTubers, what's up? Um, Mary LT here. Just figured I would uh, give everybody a uh, channel update, a uh, contest update. I've only had uh, two entries, had quite a few more subscribers. So if uh, y'all want to enter the contest, um, please feel free to make a video response. I think I'm going to let it go a little bit longer and see if I can get a few more. I know that uh, Mr. Cleaner Nash, uh, one of the my fellow YouTube buddies, he's gone on a trip this week, so he said whenever he gets back, he will uh, upload his video. He just hadn't hadn't had enough time <clears throat> past week to do it. So uh, if if y'all are wanting to do that, um, please get those up. And uh, I've opened it up where you can just set your video response, and it doesn't have to be approved by me. So just uh, add that up. Um, I'll put a link in the description or try to put one in the in the video um, to my uh, contest video. So I went out on my buddy's farm the other day and um, he brought a little 22 for us to shoot. I'd never seen one or heard of one. It's a uh, Springfield Armory um, 22. It says 1910 on it. I'm going to attach a video um, to these videos and uh, let y'all see us shooting it. It's a bolt action. He said that his dad actually shot it in ROTC. Um, I think it's supposed to be like a clone of the M1 Grand, but in the 22 caliber version. Maybe if somebody knows more about it, they could uh, fill us in because neither one of us know very much about it. But he said his dad shot it in ROTC in the basement of a school, and that school was actually located, um, I think, in downtown Nashville. So they actually got to shoot it in downtown Nashville in a basement for ROTC training in high school. Thought that was pretty cool. The U.S. Springfield Armory 22. Um, something else I picked up. I'm sure everybody's seen these little self hill targets. We picked a few of them up. Um, I don't know what brand this is, but my my girlfriend wanted the bird so she could shoot the bird. The majority of them are uh, 22 but some of them are 380 and I mean you can't even really tell which ones are 380 I even tried to shoot at it with my AR I don't know if I hit it I might have hit it a few times but you can see took it took it like a champ my girlfriend um, she surprised me the other day and bought me some new glasses I know all of y'all have probably seen my videos. I've, I've got the Ray-Bans. They're big, heavy, and ugly. The Tom Cruise wannabe glasses. These are some Oakley radars. They're unbelievably a lot lighter. So I'll be wearing these in all my videos. And I just This is what I was carrying today. My M&P 45 Compact and my Crossbreed. Just decided I'd lay it on there and give y'all a quick look at it. It's the only way to carry a full-size gun, I feel like. Crossbreed's awesome. I had one for my Glock 27, too. But I don't know if I could ever go back to another holster for a full-size. I mean, I carry my, my SIG P238 in my pocket, so that's a little different. But I don't know. So comfortable once you get them broken in. Doesn't feel like anything's there. Definitely recommend those. All right, guys. Well, uh... Like I said, if y'all want to enter the contest, get your videos in, um, subscribe, be over 18 or 18 years old and 
be, I guess, in the lower 48 states. I don't really know why people say that. I just felt like I should say that too. But um, I'll attach the video of us shooting that 22 in here and some pictures of it. But uh, thanks again for subscribing and enjoy.